Hello, hello, let's jump back in. It's Veru with Caves of Cud. We've got our mutated human apostle sitting in the waterlogged tunnel, hopefully with two friends, if I remember correctly what we're doing. Yes. And unfortunately, no uh, way to see beyond his limits. So let's stick close to edges. I've had an interesting conversation with someone on Reddit, basically about this whole the way line of sight works in this game and uh, the fact that you can't actually Ooh. oh my guy just didn't just go die uh, you can't see basically guys often when they can see you and how that is kind of detrimental to the game but honestly I think it's just part of what is right I would like it to not die. I mean, not me to not die. I would like it to die. Uh, that is good. Let's just kill this. Yeah, you guys go kill those things. Can I sunder that thing? Oh, thank goodness. Okay, come on. Let's go bathe. We're disgusting. Oh. Jerk. Okay, get our health back up. And let's jump back in there. <laughs> Still a bit bugged up. Nothing to do about it though, really. Just get on with things, yeah. Okay, so if you would all die, that would be great. I'd like to not have to worry about having to run around that corner. Potentially get snatched up by you. Uh, you, sir, can just die. If you'd be so kind. Yep. We're getting through here. Oh, hey, look, more dudes. Uh, nothing I want. Actually, what do you guys... Either you guys have a Bernoose or anything like that on? You've got a... You both got shawls. I'm okay with that. Neither of you are dodge built yet. Oh, Sundermine is so good for those nasty big dudes. Okay, that guy's gone. That guy's gone. So, this looks like we're probably getting pretty close to having finished clearing out this... Oh, oh nice. Okay. How am I doing, actually? Three mutation points. Quite a lot of skill points. Might be worthwhile to take berate now. Oh, yeah. I need you guys to come keep me company, please. And then take a bunch of stuff. Uh, who are you? You are Johnny the Knife. You get all of the short swords in the world. That's that's what you get. Short swords. Is that all? Okay. Uh, you can also have copper nuggets. And stuff you probably aren't going to use, but there you go. And you, sir, are the heavy-handed. I'm okay with... Let's see, I don't know what I've given you right now in terms of skills. I suppose I could check. Yeah, I'll just check real quick. Oh, you've got some skills right now. Uh, yeah, I've been, I've been feeding you axe. I could probably continue doing that. Do you... Have I given you charge yet? No. Let's get you some charge. There you go. So now, whatever I get next, I can put into charging strike. To be amazing. Um, and I also need to get you dismember as soon as I can. Okay. Two more levels until you get more mutation points. 
at that point you will have another point I can put into strength or I can put it into toughness so that might be a good idea oh boy well we'll see okay so that is done don't know why I did that oh boy uh, anyway I don't know what I'm doing my head is a bit full up with stuff This episode might get a bit weird because I might have to stop at it periodically. And I might not always announce that I'm doing that because I'm just a bit. <laughs> I should actually probably be in bed, but whatever. My computer's not that far from my bed, so it should be fine. again that will sunder your minds okay so we're just trying to do this Gershling quest aren't we oh, I'm gonna leave all this loot on the floor I don't want to get too heavy let's be very careful when we go into new rooms Back out, make you make the enemy come to us if possible. Okay, I'll make sure I've got my Sunder Mind. Ah, berate. I've got other things going on for me. big problem with these guys is that they just run away where I can't see them. And then I can't, you know, protect them, which is, you know, I just want to protect them. I'm not trying to, I'm not like a parent, I'm not trying to, you know, control them f just for to control them. I want, I want to keep them safe. I've invested a lot of time and energy into these guys. We're going back. Until I can see what you're seeing. In fact, I don't know why I give them charge, except it makes them so much more effective. I guess I just need to start keeping up with them. Oh. Do I have a wall? I don't have a wall. I would like you, sir, to run away. Well, I've got my dudes trapped. Uh, one, two. Does it for me. You're my friend? You're my friend! Uh, you, sir, however, are not my friend. So you're gonna get berated. Then you're gonna get lazed. <laughs> Nice. Okay, doke. Sunder the null worm because those dudes cleave. I'm not down with having my dudes cleaved. Okay. That went pretty okay. Okay, a little bit of uh, lore there about some 
I'd say lore, but it's procedurally generated, so the extent to which you could call it lore specifically. I mean, it's not established lore that somebody wrote. Somebody wrote a bunch of stuff, and the code combines it in interesting ways to create the illusion of an established lore, which is pretty cool still. <sighs> Oh god, my sinuses right now are just ridiculous. <coughs> Sorry about that. Um, I'm gonna put a little warning at the beginning of this video saying, uh, you might not want to watch this. I'm like, ridiculously bunged up and it's not pleasant to listen to, but... Oh god, it's gonna sneeze. God. Okay, I think I think honestly I'm going to stop the video here. If I could go back in time, I wouldn't have started recording this video. But I'm glad I got a flaming mace with a battery in it. That's cool. Um, I hope it, this episode didn't offend you. Uh, if it did, please hit the dislike button and unsubscribe. Uh, otherwise, please make sure you tell your friends never to watch me. Uh, yeah, it's, I, I keep all the. I want to keep doing the opposite thing, but I can't actually tell you that I don't want you to treat yourself well. So take care of yourselves, and uh, you will hear me when you hear me. <laughs>